In this video, we're going to compare the Thoroughbred versus the Norfolk Roadster. This week in Red Dead Online, all racehorses are 30% off, while all stirrups and saddlebags are 40% off. So, let's get started. So here we have both horses on the railroad tracks, head to head, facing off one another. And as you can see, they're relatively the same height. The Thoroughbred may just be a little bit taller. Now it is one of only three available racehorses in the game, while the Norfolk is considered a multi-class horse and is available through the Moonshiner role. Now let's take a look at the Thoroughbred. Now this is with the Nacho Saddle, the best saddle in the game. And as you can see, the Thoroughbred is 10 bars of speed maxed out with 8 bars of acceleration. That is with the Nacho Saddle. Now the Norfolk, again with the Nacho Saddle, just a different color, is maxed out at 10 bars, 9 bars of acceleration. Now the Norfolk, as far as stats, is going to be your best horse in the game. So place your bets, let's get started. So on top we have Wildman riding the Thoroughbred and Annie is on the bottom riding the Norfolk Roadster. Now if you take a look on the left at the stamina and health rings, you can see the difference in the two horses. The Thoroughbred just doesn't have the stamina ring that the Norfolk does. Also has a little bit less health. However, with the Nacho Saddle, it does not really make a difference. I mean, yes, the Norfolk can ride across the map without even having to feed it or any stimulants. However, you're probably never going to do that. So, here we go. Coming up on the finish line, as you can see, no surprise there. Basically, uh, dead even tie. So the next thing we're going to do is show you the dealer options available in each horse. So first we have the Thoroughbred available in Blood Bay, Dapple Gray, and Brindle. The Brindle being the one that you would want with the max stats. So next we're going to go to the Norfolk Roaster. It's available in six options. Black, Speckle Gray, Rose Gray. Now Piebald Roan never saw a Crayola in that color. Spotted Tricolor and dappled buckskin. Now those bottom two are going to be your best statted Norfolks. So as far as what recommendation would be, hands down, you're going to go with that Norfolk. Now you will have to purchase the Moonshiner Roll and you're going to have to rank it up to 20 before you can get those best statted Norfolks. However, if you're Red Dead Rich, got a lot of gold bars laying around and wanted just a little variety in your stable, Go with a thoroughbred. It is one of three available racehorses in the game. This will be your tallest racehorse. And the racehorses do have a little bit different stride. If you own, you know, the different types of horses, you can tell the difference. So that's going to wrap up this video. Be sure to tell me what you think. Now, you know, I do break out a thoroughbred every now and again when I hunt. I prefer a taller horse. Maybe you don't. Maybe you do. But drop me a comment. Let me know. I'll get back with you. If you found this video useful, hey, drop me some love. Maybe even that sub. Thank you for watching, and I'll catch you guys next time.